you guys once once you are done setting up your page your home page or creating your home page you will have to um set up the home page as your as your main page of the website you understand because currently we have this which is an empty page with nothing info so we will use the information the page that we created as to replace this you understand so that when everyone goes to the platform they will see that yeah this is what we actually put here so from that you go to um appearance and customization so appearance and then you go to customization okay so then we move to home page settings you understand then go to static page from the static page you select the home page the page that you just created you select that one then the page will be updated yes so you see that it has been updated to the to the um the, the, the page we just created yes and then you see that this one this sidebar is actually covering this sidebar is actually covering our home page which is not making it um appear or making it uh allowing it to allow a lot of things to show you understand? so you can take the sidebars to from there and then you can go side by settings then you will check out the margins that you want it or if you don't let me see if they have the options to take it out from there which is they don't have for now so and since it's a blog site you can leave it like that so that it will show the um, recent posts and everything on the page and so now once you are done you click on this um, and then go back to your dashboard so when we are we refresh on our system you see that yes our site has been updated you understand you see that home page this is actually our blog home page which you can design right away right now and then you can add other sections and other parts of um other parts of your website so now we are going to create um a menu and actually we are going to add more pages actually in a menu um when i say more pages in the menu it's just like this um this website has everything which um we have you see we have we have this thing here this thing top here which is the the menu so you have the home you have the uh, all services you have the about you have shop and actually okay, so we are going to create a menu for this site and we are going to have maybe a home about and then maybe a shop page you understand? so home about and a shop page so we will go to our pages again then we create another page which will be about which will be named about page but we are not going to put any content there so you just publish and go so we put the content in later yes then we create a shop page so we create a shop shop then we go back again then maybe create contact contact so once we are I see that we have created the pages but none of them is showing you will see that we have created the pages but none of them is showing here you understand so we have to add it to this um to this uh how do you call it to this menu to this line so that they will all be here so you go here and then go back to appearance and then you go back to customization uh, menus are also another option to that but we'll do that later So we go to menus and create a new menu, which we can name it as um, the primary primary menu because that's that's going to be our main menu. So primary menu. So it's going to be we are not going to use it at the top, but it's going to be our main menu. So we take the main menu, then we move to next. So, so you just add items to the menu so you remember we created this that and that so 
you can be sitting between you can be sitting or you can be moving between it so you have this one this and that the whole movie here yeah. we have two we have about here three So guys, you see that we have our pages now here. So now, once you you want to are done, then you click on publish. You get it? Yeah. So once you are done, you click on publish, and then you can check back your website. We see that who is everything. We have all our pages here that you can do a search, you can contact, you can shop, and anything. So guys. This one, this shop is an empty page. This about is an empty page. Contact is an empty page, and the whole page is actually mainly our first page. Yes. So this is basically what we've learned um in this basics of in this um, web development basics. Understand? And I want to tell you something. Um, I want to tell you something that um this this site that you have done is not hosted on the internet you understand it's not hosted on the internet as of now because now it's from your local computer so no one can access it unless you and even if you, you want to access it you always have to on it turn it on from your computer before you can be able to access it now we need to move it um further to the um advanced stage where we we, we move to we go to live you, you move the the web uh, the site to live um, to become a live website and then also we will have to know ways to monetize site like a way that we can get money from the site you understand then we are going to add a store just like um a store like um so like a store like Zoomia. So in advance, you'll be creating a store like Jumia like this. Have you seen how nice this platform is? Yes. So you'll be creating a platform like this. And then you will have you will create another one like this, actually, which is a company website or actually something like this. Yes. So what we will do is that um in the advanced level, we will have to want to pay something before we can be able to get the token, which is 70 Ghana cities. So if you want to join and take the learning to the advanced level, then you go to this platform, um, everything rich that's online. I'll leave the link in the group so that when you when you open the website, you go to um data marketing. You understand? So you scroll down to data marketing, then you click on start your course. Yes, so when you click on start your course, this is what you open. So data skill acquisition. So you have access to what we did all the documents that i hope that you have it already but you have access to the documents the pdfs and the videos everything then we go to the advanced level where we will do plugins so the plugins are simple with let's say you want to build something like this understand have you seen how these sections are and this this thing or they use plugins have you seen how these things are they use plugins and everything to do that which will be learned in the advanced level actually so we we'll also have um we use page builders like Elementor. You understand? Elementor is, is one page that I use to actually build this page and you see how nice this one looks. And then we'll be doing how to hide pages. We'll be doing CSS classes, um CSS classes like like um adding codes to your WordPress. Then we do live hosting as well. We create a database from our hosting account and add it. Then we will actually uh, show you how to actually host um get your source code after get your source code have you seen you, you you build everything from wordpress but you'll be able to get access to this code have you seen you'll be able to get access to all this code as if you coded everything yourself ditto ditto with the programming language yes we will teach you how to get all those stuff so and then you get access to um facebook mastery the digital marketing full course uh, like how to create facebook ads and then yes and instagram ads actually and how to use them and one of the the the, the, the amazing thing is that all these things is set for 70 cities you understand? just 70 cities and you are into, you are good to go um and be part of this um amazing course and hey you can't wait
you just click on this pay to register so when you click on pay to register it will take you just for the form then make your payment after your payment will be redirected to to get access or to join the course group you understand yes so this is basically how it is so guys this is the end of the basic course and i believe that you learned something i'll be waiting for you in the advanced class